Hey guys, welcome to Transwest Truck Trailer RV in Federal, Colorado. Um, we are 30 minutes out of the uh, Denver International Airport, just off the I-25. So if you guys are looking to come in, uh, we got some great inventory here at the moment. Um, as they come, as they go, um, it's a very uh, stiff market right now. Everything is just, uh, everything that comes in just keeps on going quickly. So um, today we still have this 2019 Ford F-350 single wheel. If you guys are interested in this unit, we're gonna do a quick walk around around this vehicle um, and kind of show you guys a, f a few of the features. Right now we are hooked up to a three horse, uh, horse trailer. Uh, this one is a good snack ball. Uh, this truck is built to be able to carry a fifth wheel or a gooseneck uh, hitch. So whichever one you guys decide to put on there, it does have the puck system in that and I'll show you guys what that looks like um, in a minute. But in the meantime guys, uh, just want to go over some of the, the features on here. As, as a quick glance, you guys can see right now uh, the two-tone um, on there. It is a white platinum tri coat and it does have that kind of a brownish tan color on the bottom all tires are in pretty good shape um, we are looking at firestones 275 70 r18s all original ford rims running board all done from the Ford factory as well. As you guys can see, it is the Lariat edition. F350 mark on here. It does come with tow mirrors, and those mirrors does extend, depending on what how big your trailer is. Um, very good feature to have. It does have a keypad entry like most Fords have. A lot of people do love that feature on, uh, on the Fords. So they need to get something in the vehicle quickly, don't have the key they could put in their password, enter the vehicle, and of course, lock the vehicle after that. Right now, I got all the windows, uh, all the windows down, but this truck does come fully tinted, so you guys don't have to worry about um, tinting that truck up. Um, if you take a glance of the inside, we have that tan interior. Nice gray leather, in super great condition. So we'll take a quick look at the back seat. It is a crew cab, so you got tons of leg room in the back here. Um, the, the back seat does fold. And of course, we have a storage box in here. That storage box would also fold flat, so you have more of a, of a floor, floor space. So if you guys decide to do that. This truck does come um, with the gooseneck hitch. Um, it does come with the tie downs for your puck system for the gooseneck. It does come with the uh, adapter from a three inch to a two and a half inch receiver. Right now we have a three inch hitch, um, bumper hitch on this truck. One thing I like about the Lariat and above is the, uh, the option of charging on the center console right there. Uh, you got all three options here from the 12 volt to the USB parts to the 110 plug-in as well gives you all the options any of your family members would need. This truck is diesel, so you have your diesel tank here, and of course it does have that DEF system as well. It is a single wheel, like I mentioned earlier. Um, we have a lot of people who love that single wheel instead of the dually. Of course, uh, less tires to, uh, to maintain and, and to buy. And this one is the FX4 off-road package. And one of the big features about the FX4 package is the skid plates underneath the truck um, to protect the fuel tank, to protect your transmission and engine underneath. Uh, so those skid plates are all underneath there for protection in case you guys decide to go off-road in. Um, the protection, having anything punctured underneath there um, will keep you safe. Checking on the back here. Like I said, we do have a three inch uh, bumper hitch and you do have the adapter here to change it to a two and a half inch. Uh, with that hitch, you do have a seven pin and a four pin hookup here. 
And of course, this little switch here, put the key in here, will lower your spare tire in case you need it. It does come with a backup camera, tons of lighting in and out of the, of the bed of the truck. As I fold this down, you guys could see right now, we are hooked up to that gooseneck ball. Because of video, we didn't put the chains together, but we do have the, the adapters that would go into those puck system, um, those little circle um, you see here. We have the adapter that goes inside there for your tie downs. And of course, if you decide to put a fifth wheel hitch, those four holes on either side will be able to put that system in, lock it in place, and you have your fifth wheel set up already. So all you guys need to get is a companion hitch or BMW hitch, whichever fifth wheel hitch that is compatible with this uh, puck system, um, you guys will get. Um, we are hooked up to a seven pin on this uh, for our trailer. And of course we have a switch right in the back here that will turn on the lights in the bed. Right now it's a little bit bright out so you won't see those lights, those LED lights um, on, but yeah, we do have a switch right here for that. And I can turn that off, close up that. All right, as we continue, we got rear and front sensors on this, uh, on this truck. And now we take a closer look here at the uh, passenger seat. It's all electric. So we got electric seats on both front seats. They both come heated and cooled uh, seats. Um, nice front storage. When we go inside, I'm gonna show you guys how the storage compartments look. Of course, the tow mirrors on both sides. That is how it works. Like I said, it's a 2019, for all those just tuning in, a 2019 Ford F-350. Has a little under 47,000 miles. The previous owner took very good care of this truck. Um, and again, guys, right now you're looking at the engine. This is a 6.7 Power Stroke V8 diesel engine. And it is partnered with a six-speed automatic transmission. You're looking at 450 horsepower and about 935 foot-pounds of torque. LED light for working at night. Very easy to open and close from the inside and then when you're closing from the outside, all you gotta do is just a nice hard slam. Does come with tow hooks, chrome bumper, nice big head, um, headlights. And let's take a look inside, guys. I wanna show you some features that um, that I really like with this unit. This does come standard with a uh, remote start. So this is what your key fob looks like. Uh, it has four different buttons here, open, lock. That's your remote start with a double click once the vehicle is locked and a panic button. This will alert you if you're parked in an in a area that you're not sure where your truck is. All you could do is just hold onto that panic button and then the horn will keep on blowing and that's where you will find your vehicle. Um, if you want to turn that off, all you got to do is hold down on the panic button again and we'll turn it off. It is a key, it's not push to start, but it does have a key that uh, opens. And of course, put in your key and turn it. As of this video, um, Mileage on this is 46,227 miles. One thing I wanted to mention on the driver door, um, we got three settings here for um, memory. So the driver could set his or her seat, pedals, mirrors, and you could trigger one, two, or three. So once you come into the vehicle and you know which setting you're more comfortable with, you press that one, two, or three, wherever you decided to, to put it. Um, even with your mirrors, your mirrors, uh, once you tune your mirrors the way you want it and you set it, it will automatically um, set your mirrors the same way you had it previously. Um, it does come with folding mirrors as well. So as you guys could see, the mirrors will fold in. 
um, especially if you have a tight parking spot or in your garage where you have multiple vehicles and you need to pass through um, you could actually fold those mirrors as well come in very handy powered windows one good thing about the two front windows they are automatic so if you just give it one touch it will automatically close itself and with one press down it will automatically open itself so you don't have to like you know constantly bring it down or keep your hand on it for, for the back windows they are not automatic but uh, very easy to operate so you could just close those up as you wish but the front windows I like that feature as well on the left hand side um, we kind of miss it on the first time around but uh, we do have all our light options here as well located right here um, but just behind the steering wheel uh, that will give you your automatic lights if you want to do um, do that um, if you just want your parking lights on um, all the different options here as well um, of course it's automatic so you do have your brake pedal and your gas pedal here this pedal here is for your parking brake so if you decide to put your parking brake on that you just press this down and when you want to release it there is a release park brake here it actually uh, is marked out pretty pretty clear same brick release um, on the steering wheel we got a few controls here you could actually control your volume and change your stations um, with this setting here and everything on your dash here you can control with these buttons up here it does have cruise control so this is your cruise control um, buttons over here and of course hands-free calling so you do have your answer and end calls uh, mute button and of course voice activated um, commands here as well this truck does come with uh, Android and uh, Apple capability so once you plug your phone into one of those USB ports located on, um, underneath the AC controls it will automatically put your phone into the system up here and of course you could receive calls um, receive uh, text messages Siri or Android um, or Google will actually read those messages to you so you don't have to look at your phone and uh, you know see those messages um, it is four-wheel drive so you have all your four-wheel drive options here two high four high and four low um, it is a 350 so you have your trailer brake system on here it's already installed and of course over here is your volume control for your media and down here is all your AC controls like I said it does have heated and cool seats so the AC they are clearly marked red is for heated seats and of course this is your fan levels it goes all the way to 7 and all the way down to 1 or you could turn it off altogether so nice little hidden storage compartment here so once you plug in your phone you could drop your phone in this box get it out of sight out of mind so if anything happens it goes straight on your screen so you don't have to worry about your phone your cup holders a little storage box here as well inside here is a huge storage compartment also has a 12 volt hook up here as well a nice little coin and key compartment more cup holders in the back here and in the center of the seat as we look in the back here we got a rear window this one doesn't come in for sunroof and I have a lot of customers that don't fancy sunroof so just having that rear window is pretty good to have it is automatic so you don't have to go in the back there and close it we have a switch located right up here um, seats are in great condition again guys it's only a 2019 with only 46,000 miles um, if you guys are interested in this vehicle like I said, the market right now is crazy. Um, so if you guys are looking for a 110 pickup, we got a few options on this lot right now, from single wheels to dualies, um, from our freight liners as well, to our Peterbilts. Like we got, we got some good inventory right now. Even though our inventory is low, but we have a variety, a variety of uh, um, options for you guys if in case you want to go from a one ton to a three quarter ton to a half ton we have those options here as well so if you guys are interested please give me a call today yours truly marlon blendman at 303-684-3412 or you guys could call me call or text me on my cell at 661-755-4344 or you could email me at marlon.bledman at transwest.com if you guys want more information about this unit 
or any other units on our lot and we'll definitely help you guys out give you all the information that you need and of course work a great deal to keep you guys um happy as our customers but in the meantime guys uh, please stay safe out there um and we'll see you guys tomorrow for another video and of course thanks to you guys for tuning in not forgetting we do buy and sell trucks so if you guys do have a truck you just want to sell to us uh, feel free to contact me also um, we'll get you some good numbers if you guys are happy with those numbers it will be a very easy process um, I cannot stress how easy that process is selling trucks to us um, so just let us know if you have one in stock um, we'll take a look at it give you a good number and of course we'll make this as smooth as possible for you guys but in the meantime thank you guys for tuning in have a great day and have a safe week thank you very much